Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It is another Transit Tuesday and I am enjoying driving my Ford Transit today. And as I'm driving it, I got my buddy back there. That is, his name is Ford as well. That's Ford, our five month old Yellow Lab puppy. I am headed into the shop right now and I am so excited to show you what new product actually today that we are going to be revealing on Transit Tuesday because you know I love bringing you guys cool new products but I think this might be the coolest product up to date that we have brought you for the Ford Transit. I mean this is a uh, I'm gonna call this, a. this could be a game changer, you know? So you're gonna wanna make sure you hang out for this whole thing, watch what we have going on, and um, because I'm sure you're gonna want this. I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure. So I'm pulling into the shop now. Here it is and all the craziness, lots of vans. Uh, I'm excited to show you guys this. I'll be back in just a second. All right, so here it is, guys. I am really, really excited to talk about how I fit a 33 or 285 70 17 tire under my Ford Transit. Now, you guys have seen this before in um, some of the Transit Tuesday videos where we talked about the new Coastal Cruiser kit, which was a two inch lift kit. And a lot of you guys have two inch lift kits and wanted to go bigger on your van. Well, now I have a way for you to go bigger on your van, and that's gonna be with this new kit. This is actually going to be a three inch lift spindle that we did on the front of this. So this lift spindle will work with a two inch van, and now it's getting us five inches of lift on this Ford Transit to be able to fit this big tire. Now, of course, I want you to know that there was some trimming involved in order to get this tire to fit. And as you can come up here and see, the front of this bumper has been cut away quite a bit. And we also came back and trimmed our the back, the part of our wheel well here as well. So there is some trimming necessary if you wanna be able to run this tire, but now a 33 inch tire? This is really cool. I would love to hear what you think about this. We're gonna jump to the back of this because we didn't stop in the front. We also have something really cool in the back of this Ford Transit. Let's check it out. When it comes to lifting the rear of your van, you're gonna have a couple of different options. Of course, you can just run a block and you're gonna maintain the factory-like ride that your Ford Transit van has. So in this one, we opted for a progressive set of leaf springs. The benefit of that leaf spring is going to be the amount of leaf springs that are in it. So it's gonna be a six to seven leaf pack for this particular van. And the progression is going to be a lot greater using thinner material on each individual spring. The lift is also built into the arc of it, which is really designed to help give you a better ride. We didn't stop in the back with the springs though. We also added a set of Fox shocks to the rear of this to control that ride in there. One thing I do want to mention as far as when you do the progressive springs, because this is a unibody, it doesn't have a frame with a body on it. You do get a little bit more noise out of the springs um, and with the new bushings in there. So I just want you guys to keep in mind, but I think that it's well worth it due to the ride quality that you're going to get for it. Like I'm gonna go with the progressive springs. So guys, this is our five inch lift kit now for the Ford Transit two wheel drive van. I'm super excited about it. I can't wait to get it on your vans as well. If you guys have any comments, questions, anything, please put them down below. I look forward to answering them for you. And I guess that's it. That's all I got. I got five inches of cool transit for you. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.